Yo, what's up? Quick update on Solana. As you can see, we are currently trading around um, $211 actually. And um, yeah, we did not manage to break out uh, from this huge resistance at approximately $216 because I think the problem right now is very simple for me as a technical, uh, from the technical perspective, guys. So imagine you've been buying, let's say, Solana, you've been accumulating around $235, let's say. This is the, I would say in this area right here, the average guy is somewhere sitting around $236 to about $230, let's say. And then we broke down and right now we are currently retesting this area around $217 again. And you are currently down about 9 to 10%. So from the psychological perspective, you, of course, you think, Okay, I'm selling right now for about 10% loss. And then if Solana is going back up, let's say to about $230 again, I just get back in. And that's why a lot of retailers are currently selling their positions because we have all these backholders sitting right here. And I believe that's the biggest reason why we are not able to break through this resistance right now. If you take a look, if you compare, uh, for example, Solana with AVEX, you can see, guys, First of all, I took a perfect long entry right here, perfect breakout trade, and my take profits are getting hit right now. And yeah, let's say um, you're comparing it to AVEX, and um, you can see, guys, that we have no overhead resistance for AVEX above $140, $150. There are no people selling from, uh, from the upside to the people who are currently buying um, from below, guys, and that's why we are currently seeing this type of selling pressure for Solana. But I think um, if Bitcoin is also to continue to go up, we will see sooner or later a huge um, pump and then we will take out this area around $218. So yeah, I believe that we will trade maybe in the next one or two days. Actually, I would say between this demand zone around $205 and this huge supply zone around $221, guys, because like I said, we have first of all to take out this huge resistance right here and then we be um we should able to retest this area around 234 dollar again in the worst case i think we could maybe break down again to about 205 dollar actually to retest this support area right here and also it was a very significant resistance from the past price action as you can see guys We've been retesting this resistance a couple of times and i believe that even if we are going down back to about 205 dollar i think we will see a huge bounce from here and i will wait just right now until we are reaching maybe this area right here between 221 to about 227 dollar and if we will break out through this area and we will see some kind of sideways consolidation above it then my next target would be at approximately $234 because this is the last significant resistance we have to take out for Solana right now. Um, so the uh, most important part for uh, if you want to trade it, take a look at the overall chart, guys. We are still in a very healthy um, bull trend right now. You can see that we are still making higher lows in the 4 hour and in the daily time frame. We are still in a huge uptrend even if we are down right now about 19 or 20 percent. I believe that we are still very bullish and I think right now around 216 dollars is a great opportunity to accumulate Solana at this area and then you just hold it for example long term until we are reaching let's say 300 dollars and then you would be already up 40 percent of your investment and I believe that if Bitcoin is also continue to go up in the next one or two months, Solana will also follow and then we could easy reach a price target of about $300. So take the chance, guys, accumulate just right now and hold it for the long run. And then you will be happy in a couple of months when you're already up 40, 50, 60 percent of your investment. I don't want to give you any moonshots, guys, then Solana is going to $1,000 or $2,000 this year because this will definitely not happen. But be patient, don't get greedy, guys. Just accumulate, buy the dips, buy every 10, 15% dip and just hold it. And if you would make it in the, if you would bought every dip right here in the past price action, guys, then you can um, just calculate how much you would be up already. So yeah, that, that was the quick price prediction for Solana. If you're enjoying these type of videos, guys, please drop a like, subscribe to my channel. If you have any questions, just comment down below. And I hope I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.